Hey and welcome to this tutorial. Because Red Hat, the company behind CentOS, has officially ended their support for CentOS 8 at the end of the year 2021, I will show you how to migrate from CentOS 8 to either Alma Linux, Rocky Linux, Oracle Linux or CentOS Stream. All mentioned distributions are compatible with the original CentOS 8, meaning your current projects running on CentOS should run on each of them in the same way. But before we start, think about if you even need a migration. If you have no important data on your instance, a reinstallation might be an easier solution. For example, if you are a Contavo customer, you can do this right from the customer control panel. Most other providers also offer such an option in their dashboard. If you decided that you want to migrate and keep your data, let's start. You will find timestamps of the specific distributions on the screen, as well as in the description. You may also refer to our blog post article online, the link will be in the video description. Migrating to Alma Linux. First, make sure that you have admin privileges by using sudo -i. Now, update your current distribution with dnf update. Continue by downloading the Alma Linux distribution from GitHub with this command. All used commands will be in the description as well. After you've downloaded the script, use this command to make it executable. Now run the script with this command. The installation process can take several minutes depending on your system's hardware and internet connection. After everything is installed, reboot your server by using the reboot command. Migrating to Rocky Linux First, make sure that you have admin privileges by using sudo -i. Now, update your current distribution with dnf update. Continue by downloading the Rocky Linux distribution from GitHub with this command. All used commands will be in the description as well. After you've downloaded the script, use this command to make it executable. Now run the script with this command. The installation process can take several minutes depending on your system's hardware and internet connection. After everything is installed, reboot your server by using the reboot command. Migrating to CentOS Stream First, make sure that you have admin privileges by using sudo -i. Now, update your current distribution with dnf update. Start the installation with this command. The installation process can take several minutes depending on your system's hardware and internet connection. After the installation is done, you have to change the repository for CentOS Stream with this command. This process will again take some time. Now let's sync all your existing packages with the new distribution by using the following command. This will take some time again. After everything is installed, reboot your server by using the reboot command. Migrating to Oracle Linux First, make sure that you have admin privileges by using sudo -i. Now, update your current distribution with dnf update. 
Continue by downloading the Oracle Linux distribution from GitHub with this command. All used commands will be in the description as well. After you've downloaded the script, use this command to make it executable. Now run the script with this command. The installation process can take several minutes depending on your system's hardware and internet connection. After everything is installed, reboot your server by using the reboot command.